Within the resource pack that you should have downloaded uh, within the course, we're now just going to have a quick look at the data and just give it get a bit of an understanding of the data so that um, it's it's familiar to you in the back of your mind as we dive into some of these um, calculations. Okay, so what we've got here is we've got uh, an organization that sells something, right? It's it's a very sort of simple and generic um, data set. And the reason why I keep it like this is because obviously we've got to appeal to a broad range of analysts who are taking this course. Um, but what I will say with this is that the techniques that we go over and the techniques that I talk to you about are replicable across any data scenario, okay? there You, you may think that there is something unique about your data, but I'm saying, I, I'm, I'm being honest here, in most cases there is nothing new. It is, a, it is the same sort of structure. You want to build the same sort of structure around your data tables as um, as we do as, as we do in this particular course, right? How we, how, you know, in terms of setting things up, getting the data model correct, and then, you know, writing DAX formula. There's, in terms of the um, methodology to run all this, you know, it's going to be very similar. There might be the odd thing that is, that is different, you know, and, or a few things that are different, but um, you know, this is a, the mind for um, you know, the structure you want to get into your mind around how to actually develop things in Power BI. Okay, so we've got some sort of just information. We you know we've got a range of different orders. So every transaction here, we've got a range of different products. We sell at different locations. We've got salespeople, customers. We've got dates that we sell on, and we've got quantity, right? And then if we jump to some of our other tables like products, we've got a bit more detail about each different product here, locations that we sell in customers and salespeople okay so we're going to bring this into our power bi models and we're going to model it up how yeah and we're going to model it up in the in the relationships area um in the model area and then you know we're going to start working away at some dax and get a get far more familiar with um some of the underlying theory and also practical application around um, dax formulas okay so that's all short and sweet there Let's um, let's move into the next video and just quickly set up our model, I think. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll just run through this quickly because that's what we covered in a bit more detail in the Ultimate Beginner's Guide to a Power BI. But it's good revision and it will get us set up inside of um, the front end of Power BI so we can start working away with some measures, etc. Okay, let's dive into that. One second.